Malalai Joya has been called the bravest woman in Afghanistan. Joya was elected the youngest member of the Afghan parliament and suspended for her outspoken criticism of the country's top officials. According to the Toronto Star, these days, Joya sleeps in safe houses with a rotating squad of bodyguards securing the doors. She only goes out in public wearing a burqa. Her wedding was held in secret. Joya has survived at least four assassination attempts and is angry at the oppressive life she is forced to lead, dodging enemies she has denounced as bloody-handed warlords and drug kingpins. Refuting once-stated claims by the invading Western powers that the war was about liberating Afghanistan's women, she said, quote, Liberation was just a big lie. Reacting bitterly to Afghan President Hamid Karzai's scandal-plagued re-election, Joya says his term is already tainted by the corruption, criminality, and violence of those around him. And she says President Obama, who is considering escalating the war against the Taliban, should think again. She told the Star, quote, The United States should leave. As long as foreign troops are in the country, we'll be fighting two enemies instead of one. Joya says that even though a departure of foreign troops may raise the risk of civil war, it would still be better than, quote, night raids, torture, and aerial bombardment that have killed hundreds of Afghan civilians while the Taliban has made steady gains.